Hey guys, it's Finn and what we have here is the PS4 built-in video game capture and editing software called Share Factory. Since I don't have my capture account yet, I decided to give it a try and see what, I, what kind of videos I'm able to bring with this software. And the quality you're able to bring is surprisingly good. You're able to bring footage of 20 minutes at maximum or 40 clips, so uh, that's a good length. Here you can see me build my little treehouse of horror in Minecraft PS4 edition, so that's cool. The quality of the video barely drops from the actual gameplay, if at all. Personally, I might experience some drops in the frames, I can't quite put my finger on it. It might just be me, or perhaps there is a slight drop in quality compared to the gameplay, but it doesn't really even matter since we're talking about an amount that you barely notice, so it's really good. The software might seem a little confusing in the beginning, but it's very user friendly, so even a video editing amateur might be able to bring some pretty decent videos. This is of course my tryout video, so I did start doodling around with the software features. I for example added a cool looking video game themed watermark in the top left corner, you can see it says Finhell, top left corner, plus some other effects here and there, and intro and outro combination, so that's really cool. I also added some heavy music in the background as you might might have noticed already, which doesn't really go together with some peaceful Minecraft footage now that, now that I think of it, but what the hell, let's go with it. <laughs> While I'm not 100% satisfied with this software myself, it's really good, but I'm not quite there able to, you know, accept this uh, instead of HDP VR and Sony Vegas Pro combination. I do admit that I do believe this software is perfect for those who are thinking of taking up gameplay commentating or montage making or whatever professional uh, video producing YouTube channel thingy. So I think if, some, if someone is thinking of taking up something like that, this kind of software is really good thing for a start at least. My only problem with that would be however that the heart and soul of this software heavily relies on the share factory's sample music, effects, the transitions and intros. So if a lot of people start making videos with this software, you might start seeing a lot of similar video effects and other editing clips from different users. So if you're thinking of starting a YouTube channel with share factory videos, I would advise to go easy on the editing effects and sample intros and outros and music since chances are that a lot of people use the very same stuff on their videos. But if you just make videos for fun then go ahead and knock yourself out. My name is Finhale, I'm out.